In this video, I quickly want to cover uh, an individual tool called Retopology Paint. This tool allows you to <laughs> obviously retopologize an object by painting on it, or selection of objects in this case. So I'm going to take these two spheres. I'm going to run uh, Retopology Paint. Okay. Now, here are the options. Accuracy, I usually leave it to. Offset is basically how far offset from the surface your new object is going to be. I wouldn't go crazy with it because the further off you come off an object, the more inaccurate it'll be or the more weird it might look. Segments can change. I'm not even going to get into that just yet. Uh, these two options allow me to freeze the object while I'm painting and to x-ray the object while I'm painting. I'm going to leave those off for right now. Uh, so I'm going to select these and say grab selection and start painting. So I'm going to go ahead and just paint basically a profile like so across these objects. I'm going to try and draw one there like so. Okay. And there we go. Uh, and I'm going to say, okay, I need, you know, there's, I don't need 10 segments. So I'm going to go ahead and lower those to say uh, five and then and painting. So what I end up with is an object that is shaped to match the object that I drew on. Real easy, real simple. Let me show you that again but with the offset on a little bit. So let's grab selection. I'm going to make the offset 0.5 and I'm going to start painting again. Now when I let go you can see it's, well you can't see from there but you'll see when I get to the other edge of the sphere that it's offset from the surface at 0.5. Let me see if I can get it to... Now watch when I let go of the, the, the mouse. See how it came up a little bit? And I can increase the face count and say end painting. You see I checked the turbo smooth which means it put turbo smooth on it at the very end. Okay? give you an idea of what it looks like. So I shouldn't put these so far apart. It comes in real handy when you're doing uh, like uh, cloth drivers and stuff like that or you want to draw a cloth object. Um, what you can also do is create a bunch of patches and then weld them together. comes in real handy uh, if you're in the middle of painting something like this uh, and you go, oh, eh, that's wrong. Just hit redo and start over. Uh, start painting. Redo. Let's make the offset 2, just so it's real obvious that the offset is happening. Okay. Hopefully you can see the offset. I'm just going to go way across here like this. All right. And then turn that on say end painting. And there you go. You can see it's been offset 2 in 2 units from the surface. Okay. I was going to get a little crazy with this, uh, but someone showed me a script uh, where the guy was basically drawing through the surface and it was doing this awesome retopology stuff and I'm like you know what that's awesome I'm not even gonna bother trying to get any further so this is just a real simplified tool to allow you to quickly make an object based off another object or set of objects um, because like I said you can paint across them if you want like this <laughs> I went backwards so what you do in this case since I forgot is you just hit the F button and it'll flip the normals. So you see how that worked? I went across them. Okay. Uh, so that's retopology paint.